interrupt your lunch, but not really. <laughs> because you were having such a good time. And this is how we learn from one another, is by talking. It is my privilege this afternoon to present two emerging leader awards. The one award goes to the treasurer of the Elkhart branch, and she is a member of the executive board. Her name is Carol Miller. Mrs. Miller has demonstrated leadership potential through her resourceful service, her commitment to the goals and values of AAUW, and her willingness to contribute constructively to the programs and activities of the group. She has a BA in Comprehensive Science from Defiance College, an MS in Microbiology from Arizona State University, a PhD in Microbiology and Biochemistry from Oregon State University. And so she has worked as a research scientist and a management executive at Ames Miles Bayer, an international corporation. So with no further ado, Carol Miller, please come forward and accept this. With our congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Sorry, did I walk the wrong way? <laughs> if I could walk that way. The other person in it, and she is in your book, is from Fort Wayne, and her name is Kathy Huff. And I'm going to give this certificate to you, Marie. All right. Now, I want to recognize the following branches. And some of these branches do not know that they're going to be recognized. But they've had very great ideas. You want to no, okay. okay. <laughs> First of all is Valparaiso. I'll tell you what. I had the opportunity to, to go to one of their branch meetings, and it was so much fun. And one of the things they are excited about is the fact that they no longer have a book sale, but they're going to have a boot sale. Now, not the boots that you wear, but you know the English translation <laughs> trunk sale at Kmart and uh, they have that and I'm curious to see how that's going to turn out so that's an in ingenious idea and with the president of Valparaiso or Marianne Thompson either one come forward and accept this certificate All right, to the Indianapolis branch. Um, the Indianapolis branch joined with the League of Women Voters and Church Women United in sponsoring a meeting regarding pay equity. And they distributed their payday candy bars. So, where is Teresa? I lost some of you. <laughs> Congratulations. It's a great idea. And that material is out there in the windowsill. To the Fort Wayne branch for your initiation of the website and <laughs> your International Women's Day. Congratulations for that. And if you haven't been to Fort Wayne website, please do. To the South Bend branch who developed how we would like to recognize you because you work with these girls and educate them about women's issues and encourage them to have a strong self-image. And thank you so much, darling.
and to the Elkhart branch who has done explorations in education, community, and service. And their materials are out on the windowsill too. Sandra, are you going to? I guess. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, and to the Calumet branch who hosted a women's financial empowerment seminar for women of all ages. We want to recognize you. And finally, to the Anderson branch, um, who had a third world community sale with an ingenious membership drive at the same time. <laughs> Thank you for all your hard work, and I want to see all of you up here next year.